Hi, a nice welcome from Rafting Tigger. How to set up your trekking trees version 2.0. First, unpack the parts that are in your pack. Pole, extensions, hammock foot, anchors, and guy lines. along with the snow baskets and rubber tips. Loosen the adjustment arm and shorten the pole fully. Install the rubber tip for tarp protection. Unscrew the trekking foot. Screw on the extension. Screw on the hammock foot. Remove the top knob and the wrist strap. Turn the trekking foot upside down and screw it on above the hubs. This acts as your tarp extension. Never hang your hammock above the handle section. Repeat for the second pole. You'll notice there is no right order for a lot of the steps. Consider leaving the extension off of the head end. See slightly later in the video where the extension section is removed. You can estimate anchor distance by placing the poles top to top. Unroll the guy lines and toss the ends to where the anchors will go. Place the black loop over the tang on the hubs. Use the two tangs that are closest together for the guy lines. Rinse and repeat. Now, go set your anchors. This one is a large orange screw. With the guy line larks headed over the top. This one is a large orange screw. with the insertion tool used as a toggle. This is a 40 centimeter boom stake and a DIY four ounce hammer. 
rocks work really well also. Watch how the guy line is looped over itself. Park the poles with the tops pointed inward. You want about seven feet between hubs. So adjust the guy lines to make it so. Pull the orange line through the black line to shorten. Always milk the berry to keep the line from sliding. Attach the hammock suspension loop to the hubs either directly as shown here or with your own suspension system. A ridge line is required but the one on your hammock works. You can also buy one from Tensa Outdoor. Angle the pole top away from the center and tighten the guy lines. Rinse and repeat. Use the pole as a pulley and pull on the orange line. Then slide the black berry down the line and milk it. Get the snow baskets. Stick them under the hammock foot. This prevents the pole from sinking. With this short suspension, the head is too high. The best way to fix this is to shorten the pole. This is a 12 plus foot war bonnet blackbird XL with under quilt and you were worried that the poles are not tall enough. Lean on the ridge line. Then retention the guy lines. Safety all the guy lines with a slippery half hitch. Now you can add your tarp. This is an 11 foot one. I'm putting the tarp end loop over the trekking tip. and find, in this case, the fit is perfect. If your tarp is longer, just go over the rubber tips. I'm slightly changing the pole angle to really make this tarp fit. Important, tarp and guy lines are a must. Check to make sure the pole feet are in line and the poles are straight. Adjust as needed.
double check. Now for the test sit. Bounce gently. Last step is to check the anchors. Look for a space gap behind the anchor. A gap shows the anchor is being pulled forward. A small gap is okay. All four anchors are good. Ready for use.